That's why I say with this trailer, it seems to be working fine. So, yeah. <coughs> Is there a way to take seed to, yeah? You could use the convey all. This thing right here. It's not the best though. I will tell you the triggers are a little wonky on it, but it's, it's okay. It's all right. Yeah. The convey all would work. For hauling seed and fertilizer, yep. I am great. How's it going? I got a pink truck. Therefore, life is good, chat, you know? Or something. <laughs> something like that, right? Oh, my. Anyway, guys, we're just moving a few sugar beets around. Uh, we want to free up the storage over here because we tend to use this one when we harvest, so... That, and I know we need to uh, upgrade our bins at our homestead, too. But we tend to just fill the train, so. Or the, the, the east silo here. So, yeah. Or something, lol. Right? Right? Oh, wow, Adam. Okay. I'm, I'm slightly impressed. What's going on? Uh, some of the animation inside the truck. Oh, yeah. The shifter yeah. actually follows the correct gear pattern. Oh, wow. I'm an automatic. I ain't got that. Automatic. Over here. The dash looks really good, though. This truck. A few, you mean 10 tons? I mean, that's only a few. Not a big deal. Not a big deal, guys. Why not the smallest one? It would work for seed and fertilizer. It would. But I don't know how the auger would get out over... Um, different seeders and stuff. The conveyor has a very, very long auger to it very long auger so yeah on trip don't touch my trip hey actually now we can put the conveyor all in here we can use this for water on one of our semis now we can quit using dollies so that's good that is mm -hmm. good What's up, Bert? Here actually doesn't look half bad either. Honestly. Oh, touch. Ah, whoa, hello. Oh, everything lights up in here too. That's nice. Looks good. Looks good. Yeah. Does not look bad in my opinion. Needs a Jake break though. Everything needs a Jake break shot. This resume hasn't converted Seed Hawk from 19. I'm pretty sure it's out there. Pretty sure it's out there already. Yeah. Pretty sure it is. Okay, so we can't plant anything right now. I need to get back to the PGA and check that out. Well, gotta keep that running. I don't think the conveyor belts are the strat there, but you know. But I get for listening to chat, right? No offense, chat. Love y'all. Swear. Where's the key? Where's the key on this truck? Oh, that's one thing I didn't look. Where would the key be? be on here. Is it? I know some keys are like left of the of the like to the left of the steering wheel. Yeah, it'd be down on the 
but versus Some are left. down on the dash on the left hand side. It's behind the uh It's behind the steering wheel over there. I don't know if it turns or not. I don't know. I can't see it. I can't see it, sorry. Good point though, Mr. Professor. You know, I have to check my keys. Invader City is today, yeah. At least until I get annoyed with them in Salmo. I'll probably get annoyed with the conveyor belts and get rid of them here in a little bit. Left of the trailer brakes. There's nothing there. Nothing that I, uh, is it? It could be that thing right there. But I can't, I can't get the wheel to like go in the right spot where I can see. Okay. Just can't see it. Unfortunately. Swaddle. Well, does this kind of truck you drive in real life? I know you drive truck. An electric? I mean, it's an automatic. So I was, oh. It's an automatic. None of that stuff with a clutch. Um, when isn't my bot broke, Bert? Oh, well, oh, he's there. The lurk is Carson, though. That's a Carson thing. I think. For sure. Oh, you don't drive a Mac. I got you. I got you. Especially not a pink one, right? Especially not a pink one. Sarge, are you just driving this the semi around? Uh, I was. I got out of it. Okay. So if you want to check it out, you can. That's all good. Do I? I was going to try to get back to that BGA and work on that a little bit. Yeah, it needs some work. Yeah. Conveyor belts are done moving. Yeah. Okay. A lot of those sugar beets have been moved. I mean, we're hauling more with the tractors and tipper anyway, let's be honest, you know. So... Trey, what's up? How you doing, man? How's it going? Yeah, we're hauling more with the truck with the subtractor than we are with the trucks. Not the truck's fault per se; it's the trailers. I usually have checked out this truck before starts. This truck's pretty awesome. The old, uh, mm -hmm. the old truck. It's a good parking. Actually, that's a. That's a great place to park trucks, Sarge. Park them at the gas station. That's a good idea. <laughs> you want to see the shifter move in the truck? Kind of dark in here, though. Yeah, that's the only downside. It's there. But it's kind of dark. It's definitely moving, though. It's definitely moving. I'm doing great. How's it going? Doing great. What's going on, chat? Welcome in, welcome in. Holy cow, everybody coming in. Hi, y'all. How's it going? Yeah, the stick definitely moves. It's just, it's really dark in the cab, so you can't really see it. But it's definitely moving. Got a chance to go outside. You have new lawn furniture in your backyard now. I mean, it's from the neighbor, huh? Assuming it's from the... Everybody's got those strong winds today, man. That's crazy out there. Crazy. Luminous Val, hello. How are you doing today? How's it going? Welcome all one in. Ow. Luminous Val, I saw you, do, you DM me. On Discord, but I looked at it when I was like half asleep, so I don't really know what you said to be honest. Uh, we're doing okay. How's it going over there? How's it going there, Luminous? Yeah, I don't really. I was like, it was like early this morning, and I was looking at my phone, and I was like, I'm going back to sleep. Oh, so I went back to sleep. 
We have super bees. Uh, they do run them in Canada. Yes. Yes, they do. You just got these, guys. You just got these. All right. Just going to let that be. We don't really need them. Off to the BGA. Yes, I bought my methane tractor. I could. Because I could. Oh, you know what happened there, Sarge? Mm. They got turned off because nobody was in them. And, like, we got too far away from the conveyors. So it, like, turned oh. itself off. That's what happened, Sarge. Oh, it's going again. I just started. Okay. One or two houses down, you think? No, it didn't wake me up, Luminous. You're good. My alerts are turned off. No, my alerts are turned off on my phone. I don't know why I woke up, though. It's all good. No worries. Yeah. Yeah, if... If we wanted to put a field in cotton or all of them or half of them or yeah. whatever, February. Okay. All right. All right, Sean, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can definitely, if you have a PayPal, you know, I can help you out. Uh, Luminous or saying. Just saying. Yeah. Um, any hoozles. So what field do we plant in cotton? Good question. <laughs> we have a cotton harvest. Yeah, we'll chat later. We got this. We got this. Uh you said February? Yeah. Okay, let me work on getting the BGA fill up full up a little bit. Yeah. Is this you uh, in the thing? Yeah. Is this yeah. somebody? You're in the mixer? I'm in the mixer. Okay. Let's work on getting the BGA fill up a little bit because it's like empty right now. All of them? The last one. Uh, no. Yeah. I don't know about that. This is my beautiful methane power tractor on uh, Tom. Um, how's it going, by the way, Tom? It's the methane tractor. That's so good. It's actually pretty good at moving conveyor belts around. I won't lie. Okay. Pretty, pretty okay at moving conveyor belts around. All right. Yeah. Same. Yeah, we have a conveyor belt set up. This chat swore conveyor belts are the way to go to move silage. If chat says it, then <laughs> you yeah, know. I'll at least try it once. Wow. <laughs> it's so cute. I'm kind of bummed it does not have hazard lights. Everybody knows I like my hazards. Not have hazards. I'm a little annoyed. Not annoyed. Just a little bummed. A little bummed, chat. A little bummed. That is all. It runs on Taco Bell. Yes, Steven. Sure does, buddy. Yeah, right, Wolf. And then for some reason, I listen. I don't know why. <laughs> some reason, I listen to you guys, and I, I really don't. I question my life, you know? <laughs> I question my life, okay? Dom, I don't even know what to talk about. I didn't see anything getting caught. To take that snowmobiling? What? It goes really slow, though. I'm the hazard. Yo, facts chat. Facts, yo. This is moving a lot, though. I mean, this is, this is working. It's just... I don't know. You know what? I know what we need, chat. I know what we need. I have not had the pleasure yet, chat. Steven 829 cheered Dex 100. You listen? You listen? Steven, thanks for the 100 bits, man. What are we doing? I'm getting a <laughs> snowcat over there. Oh, okay. To push it to the conveyor. 
Because I think Snowcat's going to be easier than moving the conveyors all the time. Probably not. But... Probably not. A little Snowcat, a little, a little silage pusher. Big deal, chat. Sure, we have no silage? No. Nope. Uh, the snowcat's been awesome. Um, Trent and all the guys, basically, who were messing with silage the other day. I know Trent did it a lot. Troy, Tom, I think. All the guys, they, they used it. Everybody seemed to like it. Problem is, I don't know if I can get on top of the pile with it right now. Uh, thanks for the uh, follow. Appreciate you. Welcome on in. How's it going? Not sure if I can make it up there or not. Infantorial. The farm must grow. There's no such thing as too much silage. I agree. Big facts. When is cooking with John? Three days from never. Three days from never. How about that? I got you, Tom. I got you. Since you don't have a big blade for the 9R, you might grab this. This would probably be better if I had the joystick hooked up, though, guys. I will say that much. Probably would be better if I had my joystick. Um, I can't push anything though. Oh no. I don't really want to do that. So I've not used this thing in case y'all can't tell. Uh the green was technically outside of the tarp. It's it's chaff. Second Tuesday of next week. What? A bobcat at eight years, eight or nine years old? Heck yeah. Sounds like stuff the farm kids in America do. <laughs> That's what that sounds like. A uh, good old bobcat. Uh, no, Snowcat would be a different company. Bobcat's actually made by Bobcat. Bobcat would be the brand. Technically, it'd be a skid steer, uh, what you're talking about, but kind of, the, kind of the same, but not really. It's on like two wheels or sometimes track or four wheels on tracks now. They have track machines now, too. It doesn't seem to cut in when you're on top of the level field. Okay. So maybe this isn't the strat then. Guys. See, it really cuts there, though. I was just hoping I could use this. I don't know. There, right, we're cutting. We're pushing. I think there's some lag going on, too, chat. You know? I think that's what it is, honestly. It's the end of the world. That's probably what's going on here, yeah. We're at the top of the bunker, so we can't push anymore. That's true. Uh, this is currently just over 3 million. It was 3.1. Hold about 100,000 out of here. Drop it, Silas, to the guys with the skids, or a bobcat. <laughs> Letting them go. Oh, ham and a side by side, yeah. But what I need to do is like push out here where it's not up to the up to snuff all the way here, yeah. Maybe that'll work better. I didn't realize I could angle the blade too. Honestly, this is just not working what I'm doing, but I'm here to mess with it, you know. I'm here to mess with it, guys. Come on. Come on. Oh, 
I just sit back and let the uh, conveyor belt do its thing. It's it's doing it, you know. It's probably the strap for now. I just need to let it be patient and let it do its thing. That's probably what I need to do. Howdy, welcome in, welcome in. How's it going? I have to go ham. Oh, jeez. Wait for it to topple? No. Goodness me. Yeah, I need to. I need to slope it out, yeah. Wow. Uh, how many fields? So we did this big field here. We did 56. And we did this big field here. So we did not forage harvest 57, 45, 46, or this one. So we definitely have more fields that we could forage harvest if we wanted to. I'm helping, right? Sorry. I'm not really helping you right now. I'm just making a mess. I just want to pretend that I'm helping. Okay, Sarge. Look at all the help it's I just did. Wow, look at me. Okay, I'll get out of your way now. You can actually work. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me. Pardon me. <laughs> That's probably the best way, honestly, is what Sarge has right now. That's probably the best way to pick up silage, honestly. You know? Which is back for now? Was it down? Push down? Yeah, that's probably the best way to actually mess with the whole silage thing, is what Sarge is doing. Been down all day? Oh no. So. Yeah, that's probably the best way is what Sarge has going on. I mean, the conveyor belts, are, it's still working, you know? Had issues a few hours ago? Uh oh. Front row. Can you dump hay into the bunkers? Uh, you can control I into them, yeah. If you own them. Dreams, no chat. Holy cow. You do have to buy the BGA to use the bunkers, yes. Yes, you do. Alright, hang on here, chat. We need to disconnect that last one. And drive it forward. Because if you notice, there's plenty of overlap here. Actually, we want to keep it back. Work from the edge of the pile in. Probably. If it's still grabbing, it's still grabbing, you know? Don't touch. We'll just leave those alone. They're working fine, you know? But you do have to buy the BGA to use the uh, bunkers. 1.5 million. It's kind of pricey, but it works. It definitely works. I see. This is what I'm going to do with this thing. Is just make a mess. If I can just keep pushing it in front of the thing, I'm fine with that. So we have not purchased the, I mean, I can, I can purchase it right now. We haven't purchased the, uh, thingamabob yet. The saddle track. If I load her, no, I'm good. I'm not going to mess with the loader. I mean, it's working. The conveyor belt, it's moved a lot of material. So, trying to get into the pile. I'm not necessarily trying to scrape it down to the ground, you know, shot. 
Because if I can take a little bite and then kind of turn out and dump it, you know, quote unquote, where it can reach, that's kind of what I'm trying to do here. I'm not trying to push the whole pile, you know. I'm trying to just kind of push a little into the conveyor belt. That's all. Sorry, you're still getting out of that pile, huh? It's good. See, I don't want to bury the conveyor belt. <laughs> Which is what I'm doing. Then I'm going to cause it not to work. It's still working, though, I think. Maybe. Yeah, it's still working. All right. I think we got it filled up. To Are where... we full? Yeah, yeah we're full because I'm not really dumping anything oh, to the house then and we'll sleep a day that's what i've been waiting for is it to be full <laughs> that's what i've been waiting for oh let the snow fly let the snow fly all right <laughs> hello there we go all right, so you said February for planting cotton, right? All right. We actually have, like, snow here at the BGA. Look at us. Dang. Need to plow some snow now. <laughs> let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Look at us, chat. We're really doing it. <laughs> oh, and then it turns to silage. It becomes a mess. Okay. All right. I'm just going to let this go because it is moving material right now. There is room. Quite a bit of room, actually. We're about to hit a million digestate, Sarge. Just about to hit a million digestate. Yep. Awesome. Uh, we do have quite a bit of room in the thing, but the conveyor belts are moving, so I say we uh, we'll find something else to do. Shame okay. can't plow the roads. Yeah, it's kind um, of crazy. Silas, yeah, it's a snow kit, right? <laughs> or can you get more out of this bunk? I probably can. Let's let's try to get as much out of here as possible, I guess. Huh? Okay. Then we'll yeah. work on other stuff. We will. We yeah. will watch you. Oops. That's not where I wanted to go. Snow is kind of cool looking, though. Kind of neat. Kind of neat, chat. Uh, thanks for that follow, by the way. Appreciate you. Welcome on in. How's it going? So, the whole digestate thing, I don't... We're not going to make any money on digestate because we're not selling it. Uh, the digestate we are going to use through the saddle track, which, you know what, we have money. We might as well just buy it. We're going to use through the saddle track. This was the pre-order bonus with uh, 22. And um, so we're going to go ahead and buy this bad boy. We've been wanting to mess with this for a long time. I think skinny duels. What do you think, Sarge? Whatever you think looks right. And you know me. I like skinny duels, so... <laughs> Uh, is it even possible? You can sell Digestate right through the BGA. Like, have it sell automatically. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, you can. All right, there's the saddle track part. And then we need to come in here to... Chew, 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 chew. What's it called? The slurry stuff. Sorry, just turned on Xbox again, chat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I heard it. Don't worry, it's fine. We are still messing with silage. Uh, the bug's not bad or anything. We're not having too bad issues. I don't know if we need the snorkel thing here, but we're going to grab it. Um, and then I want to go with the big tank. This would be a tank you'd put on the actual unit. I want to go with the tow behind tank, I think, is going to be the strat. We'll buy that. And then we'll buy the... Uh, yeah, we'll buy the applicator for it as well. Now, I don't know how much we're going to use the saddle track thing because it is kind of a smaller, like, applicator. 
So from that aspect, I don't know how much we're going to use it, but we're going to mess with it. Yeah, the cloth stuff's so expensive. So the mods will be the pack. Okay. Assuming this goes on the front. Oh man, look at this. Okay. And then this is gonna go on the back. Alright. Oh my god, the hose. Okay, look at the chat. Look at the hoses that hook up that. Oh yeah. Yes, please. Uh, when we get our silage where it's bugged out, yes, we are painting over it. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, cotton and cloth. I don't know about the whole cotton and cloth thing. I have not messed with it yet, so I can't really answer that. If it's more or less work or whatever than eggs, I don't know. So this is the problem with this whole rig. It's not very big. That's the problem with it. But start your pipe is it standing? <laughs> yeah, I have the USB smell -a vision uh add-on for twenty no, it's not a thing. Not twenty, not a not a thing. This thing is a beast. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Oh, can't wait to use this. We don't need to use it this. It'll be next year before we, or this fall technically in the game. Uh, before we actually have to use this. But, Sarge, look at this thing. Where are you at? You still in the bunker? Yeah. Oh my way. goodness. <laughs> he says, oh my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> Is this thing awesome? I like it. Can you put a larger, different brand applicator on it? Need to spray ice melt on it. <laughs> Salt brine, right, boys? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know if you can put a different brand applicator on. Send me a jar with the smell in it. Oh. Ugh. Okay. Is that on the I think I'm now? done here. Yeah. Look at how you can turn and everything too and the hoses. There. Yeah, they flex with it. Watch watch those hoses, Sarge. Oh, I can't unhook. I can't unhook. Uh I have to lower the rear implement before I can unhook. That's interesting, but see the hoses actually appear. <laughs> like it. <laughs> oh my! Uh, oh my! It's so cool. Well, silage smell. I think he's more talking about like liquid manure smell than silage, but yeah. <laughs> we'll let that go through. Why not? Uh, thanks for all the files rolled in, y'all. I appreciate them all. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome. It's not better. No, it would be worse. It would be worse, actually. Yeah. It would be worse. All right. Where do we fill up digestate? That's what I'm curious about. It should be here somewhere. Is it this thing or here? I don't actually know, chat. Let's see, let's we'll just drive around for a minute and see where if we can find a trigger. There's a few around here. They should be around. Oh, here it's probably these tanks right here. Sorry, I found it. Probably this right here, right? It's possible. No. Okay, keep going around then. Unless I'm doing it wrong, maybe I have to have the snorkel thing out. I'm just There's on the another one over here. 
Okay, I'm on the tank just trying to fill. But I don't know. Oh, that would make sense, actually, looking at it, yeah. Oh. Oh, it is filling, okay. Okay, so no hose or anything, but you do fill, okay. That's cool. Oh, it's a slow fill process, too. Is that a methane burner right here? Kind of looks like it would be one, doesn't it? Uh, or something, yeah. <laughs> like it burns off extra methane? What I'm thinking. Uh, hand I'm, warmer. Hand warmer? <laughs> it is, yeah, that's what I think. Ah, it's not that bad. It was done a minute ago. Alright, so I just want to turn this thing on. I'm not actually going to go to a field because there's no point because we fertilize with our cedar anyway, so no. Yeah. So. What do they do? We have a cotton harvester. What field are we thinking? Oh, wait. So all you got to do, you lower it and that turns it on. Uh, I don't really care, Sarge. Let's pick a field and do it, you know? That's interesting. Hang on. Hold this up. Lower it. Without turning it on. I want to use the tractor. I'm pretty sure I can just use this as a tractor, right? Why not? Alright. Uh, so guys, we're going to be playing some cotton. I'm just trying to decide if you want to do like 56, 57, or one of the big fields. I want to do that west big field. The All west right. west of the homestead. Yeah. Uh, I'm okay. only thinking one field for cotton, by the way. That's it. One field. One field for cotton. That's a very interesting setup, though, that saddle track. That's cool. Looks like a DIC. It really kind of does, yeah. Okay. Also, I have modules no there. idea where this thing normally gets parked. What's that? Uh, this cultivator. I don't know either. Um, cotton can be planted. Let's see, we are no. Oh, it can be planted right now. Okay. Mm -hmm. Must be planted. Okay, in the spring. Um, but I was gonna look. Can our Kinsey's plant those? Uh, that's what I was about to hook on to. I don't actually know. They can. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's what I was hoping we could use. That's what I was hoping. Oh, man. It's pretty lit. Oh, I really don't like when people park two of these side by side in here, though. They don't fit. And it's going to take half an hour to get it out of here. Let's see. Oh, okay. Not bad, actually. It, oh, hello. Oh, oh, Hi, Sarge. Sorry, sorry, sorry. How's it going? <laughs> I didn't let you hook this up. Why's that? Because for some odd reason, I have frame issues. Oh, that's right. right. Your frame wreck frames are terrible in this homestead, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. I got you. I got you. Right, I forgot your frames are... And I have yet to figure out why. Yeah, I don't know why. It's the only place. Oh. Yep, guys, we bought the saddle track. That is the, the pre-order bonus. Uh, from 22. Awesome. Thank we you. Just, had a problem. We just bought this. Uh, we do have all the, the, the slurry handling stuff as well, but I'm just going to use it as a tractor. Is what I'm going to do with it. Just a friendly boop. I'm probably going to turn off my four-wheel steer, though, if I can. Because with the cedar, it doesn't seem to like it. The meeting of two great minds. Who else was there besides Sarge? Wait. Get it.
Uh, not mod issues. We don't have well. We have GPS and we have the moors, and that's it. I don't believe you can spin the chair. No. I don't believe so. Let's actually let's unhook that. I want to grab away from that. Uh, so we want to toggle our steering. I just want front wheel steer. Uh, yeah, that's all we can do. Uh, that's all we can do. Toggle our steering. Still turn plenty sharp, but it'll turn better with the cedar this way. How'd you get in GPS going? Trying to. Go. Airplay, Waldo. Airplay. So we'll be Take running that looks right. the east-west line. <laughs> I didn't take. East-west. What's your width? It is... Mine come up at 5971. Right. I'm locked in. Yeah, that looks like it'd be Should about be right. right on. Okay. Wait. Sliding around with the snow. Why is it telling me I can't plant? What? Uh, are you selected on cotton? I thought I was. Carson? Uh, now Carson's running. Who that is? Uh, Walter. Oh, that was Carson. Okay. Good. Do I have the wrong seed? Oh, I am. Mine. I'm unsure. My bad. There's cotton. My bad. My bad, boys. My bad. We got it. We got it locked in now, boys. Okay, Knock did you find up. an edge? Uh, I'm just doing a smidge pass right here because it wasn't lining up. So I'm gotcha. not worried about that, you know, get her. I was going to do a lap around the field and, then, uh, or maybe two when they run with me. Yeah. I'll uh, we'll jump in behind you. Sir. After I quit doing donuts. Be cool. If you went to the edge of the map, go to a different one. What is this? Snow runner? Go through a tunnel. <laughs> oh man, this is really weird planting in the snow, by the way. Oh my god, this thing. The the visibility out of this thing is like a combine. This is so weird. <laughs> this thing is so weird. Uh where's the key though? Chat it doesn't have a key. There's it should be right there, but it's sad now. Doesn't have a key. Very sad. Very sad. It's very weird planting in the snow, though, right? <laughs> Send it back. I want all my money plus ten percent. <laughs> I want it all back, chat. I want it all back. Plus ten percent, okay. The glass starship. I mean, it's basically a combine cab up there, you know? Basically, what is it? Combine cab on top of the engine? It's kind of weird, but... Hey, man, whatever floats your boat. Welcome in. How's it going? Welcome in. The cup holder? I don't see a cup holder either. I'm sure there is one. But... Oh, God, you guys got me driving all crazy now. Looking for our cup holder. Sell it now. Junk. <laughs> need our money back, boys. We need our money back. Right now. I'm telling you, money back plus 10. Insane. Lift up higher. And... Yeah. It's kind of a weird looking tractor. I think with the tank on though, it looked really good. It looked really good with the tank on. And with the tank, you can actually use the four wheel steering and like really sharp, which is pretty cool. 
the mini fridge some combines have yeah who is it uh mike mitchell his wife's combine has a, a microwave in it which is pretty cool pretty neat substandard machine I'm telling you i want a refund not really look at it by the way it's throwing snow up behind the tires y'all that's kind of cool assume it does that with dirt too but i really paid attention to be honest okay, this is not turning out well turning is a little weird with this thing of course i don't have four wheel on because it didn't like that either so it had a glass floor you'd see the uh the hood of the tractor that's what i want to know how do you work on the hood or on the engine on this thing does the whole like cab lift up and go airborne i'm assuming kind of have to wouldn't it i think so yeah uh, that would kind of have to pretty cool actually to see it cab over. it's definitely a cab over Definitely. You're sitting on the edge of the world up there in this thing, you know? Kind of strange. Oh, the snow. I wish the tractor was leaving tracks. Yeah, that would be nice. That would be nice. Cab tilts forward. Possibly. That'd be cool to see. I have to look this up on YouTube. I have to look it up sometime, you know? Well, so it has a great turning radius if you have the four wheel steer on, but with this cedar, it didn't like it. So I turned it off. It would hit the hitch like really fast. Similar to a cab over seven. I can see that Adam. Yeah. I can see it. Oh, we lost a hill edge. Yeah. So four wheel steering was, was great of this thing with the actual like slurry tank. Uh, but with this cedar, it did not like the four wheel steer. So I turned it off and, uh, it's, it's fine. But we're going to have two end rows and, you know, maybe Sarge and I will run, uh, skippers when we actually seed. So I don't have to turn a sharp and we'll be fine. I think I'd be okay, honestly, without running skippers, but we can show off our skills, Sarge. Yeah, we can do that. <laughs> our seeding skills spent many a years together <laughs> owning our seating skills haven't we <laughs> literally <Yeah. laughs> i'm making a joke but i'm not at the same time i'm serious <laughs> many a years of farm simming together when did we start playing together was it 15 or was it 17 i don't even know I don't know what farm sim you started 17 playing. 17 for sure, possibly 15. I think it might have been 15. <laughs> it's been a while. Get out the WD-40. Let's go. Let's go. Semi-truck. <laughs> I don't know. And it was just getting maintenance. So. Uh, I'm on GPS up here, Sarge, by the way. You can lock it into if you want. Yeah, I'm Roger. Run, I'm actually on the south end field. I thought you were right behind me. Uh, No. Uh, okay. It wants it, I think. One of the other two that's in here is. I got you. Okay. I'll come run down there then when, you, when, I, uh, when I get back around. But literally many a years of farming together. Many a years. <laughs> the cab does not rotate on this one, though. No. Nope. Uh, Watson had to be 15 if uh, you're talking about like with uh, with us because we did not play 13. Uh, 
on PC back in the day, so there was no MP for us. We played on console, so it was all single player. Gave the family a good game. <laughs> Funny. Okay, I'll search it for a video. No, although I'm not. Funny. Yeah, we started the first, like, multiplayer we played with, like, viewers and stuff was 15. Westbridge Hills. With the $5 Ursas. Shout out to the $5 Ursas, right? Um, that was the first one where we started playing with, with viewers. Mm -hmm. uh, 13, there was no MP on console. So. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely remember those. Yep. Yep. A good old five dollars. It's man. I think we had a bunch of them on that server. That first server. At least that first day, because people kept wanting to join, and we're just like, "Okay, we'll get you a tractor. Go do something." <laughs> and we couldn't afford anything else, but we could afford the five dollars. So that's for sure. Had a whole pile of them things by the time we got done that day. Yeah, and that was the, that was the custom one that was done. Yeah. Guys. No, no, not that one. Now the five dollar Ursus was like an older Ursus tractor. The Ursus uh, Max and the Max track, I think, is the one you're thinking of. Yeah. That was the custom one. We we used that one later on in fifteen. Uh, Mr. Anthony made that one for us. The Max track was a beast. That tractor was very specifically made literally, literally for me and with my input. So I loved it. Absolutely loved that tractor. Yeah. The five dollars is that was a that was a beast though. The snow makes it easier to see where we need to plant a little bit, yeah. It does, kind of. <laughs> No, Chad, it's not snow. It's just a lot of lime. <laughs> it's a lot of fertilizer. Can you imagine if your field actually looked like this from fertilizer? After. Nothing would come up. It would just burn it all. It's way too much. <laughs> you ain't kidding. <laughs> it would, everything would just burn. It was as soon as it would try to spike through, it'd be done. <laughs> no shot. Oh, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> Adam, that's funny. I don't remember that, but that's funny. <laughs> no applicator, just open the back and drive fast. <laughs> that's pretty uh, seed uh, heavy, isn't it? It's kind of thirsty. I'm down to 52% already. I'm at 72 quarts, and again, you did go all the way. Yeah, I mean, I went around the field and then, like, I pass them a little bit here. Fertilizers mm -hmm. are down pretty quick too. Yeah. We need a toe behind like a, a tender for this planter to give you more fertilizer capacity. Although really you'd have to up the seed through a mod, but fertilizer mm -hmm. would be cool. Or a box for this tractor that held seed and fertilizer up on the body of the tractor would be awesome. I'm sure somebody will come out with that eventually. Yeah. That would be really cool. Oh, what is that? A little thing over here in the edge of the world. Hey, what are we okay. selling? Okay. I don't know. Who's messing with vehicles? How are we doing that? Not it. Hey, these trees are um, non facerable, by the way. Just so everybody's aware. <laughs> right, there we go. We'll get back on track and. Better patter. Okay, fair play, Waldo. Fair play. There's a skipper. Oh no. Not actually there though. Okay. okay oh, what no. was? The dollies. No. Oh. Technically we don't need them now that we have semis. Although for oh, water, true. it might be better to still use a dolly and a tractor because you go down in that pond by the BGA. I don't think a truck will pull it out of there. 
It's very aggressive. The eight R barely does it, so. Yeah. Yeah, because the semis are actually meant for roadies. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Chat, it's about three o'clock break time. Like, ah, oh, where'd the day go? Oh, vaporized. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, our day. It's gone. Not yet. This thing is a monster. A front. Oh, can you imagine? I want to put the Vicon Moors on this thing and mow. Front and back Moors. <laughs> All wheel steer. Let's go. Get to the end and just whip it. <laughs> Line everywhere. Can you imagine? <laughs> Run a baler. Will I take my break on time? Probably not. There's ten minutes. We'll get it. I'll go when we get this field done. How about that? Whenever that is. So now we're not going to be on time because there's no way we get this field done in ten minutes. All right, we can't leave skippers. Come on now, John. Can't do this. All about getting back on that GPS line faster, you know. Go, nailed it, nailed it. This is Professor. I don't think it's bad here yet. I I don't think we're under the advisory or whatever, but I don't think it's bad here yet. I'm looking, literally looking. Like a glove. It's 15 mile an hour winds right now, so not bad at all. Not bad at all. <laughs> You'll put your hand up in front of me as I stop. Mrs. Or not Mrs. Professor. I was going to thank Mrs. Professor for the follow. Appreciate that follow in the chat there. Appreciate you all coming in. How's it going? Goodness me. We're under a wind advisory today. I guess it started at 2.41, I don't know, until tomorrow at 2 a.m. So they're saying 15 to 25 mile per hour winds gusting to 55 for me. So it's not nearly as bad as some of y'all are saying, you know. So I think we're kind of on the edge of this whole thing still over here in St. Louis. Seventy to one hundred miles an hour in Colorado's. Oh my God! Still blowing twenty-five steady. Gigantic. Holy cow! It's crazy, guys. Uh, Clayton, this particular server is not joinable. But if you're interested in joining a server with people uh, that you know want to play farm sim with other people, there is a joinable server. Uh, it is what we call the Crossplay Server Exclamation Point Discord, and uh, Mrs. Professor's already on it. Uh, thank you. Uh, join the Discord if you haven't already. Scroll down on the left side. There is a Crossplay Server channel. All the information you need for that is in there, and I believe there's at least three people on the server right now. So yeah, we're not in Kansas. We're not in Kansas anymore because we blew away from Kansas. The wind blew us out of Kansas, guys. 45, but it's not there yet. Gotcha. Last the time I stepped over today. Gigantic. That's crazy. With that kind of wind, though, it makes sense, you know? It really does. Unfortunate, though, man. Very, very unfortunate. Sorry, just looking at stuff on the other screen. Shouldn't be doing that, but I am. So yeah, we'll get this field done, chat, and then I will go uh, take my break for uh, a couple minutes. And then uh, we'll continue with probably at a fast time so we can plant more of whatever other crop we decide to plant. I don't know. Uh, we do have a tender for seed, uh, not fertilizer because liquid fertilizer. Um, oh, John hit the wrong button. Wrong button chat. 
You realize you should join the Discord? Definitely join the Discord. It's a good time in there. There's uh, some interesting stuff gets posted in there sometimes. Need some kites to play with. <laughs> right? It might actually finish before three. Oh, there's our convey all seed trailer over there, by the way. So we do have seed at the field, but fertilizer we have to run to the homestead. Either the homestead or we can buy at the shop, but we have the place below at the homestead. Yeah. How to feel for Grave Trials yet? No. I'm really thinking uh, Field 11. It's out of the way. There's a fair amount of land there. You know? I was thinking Field 11. Or Grapes and Olives. Oh, both. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And we're probably not going to fill it up because they are very, very time consuming and tedious, apparently. So we're probably not going to fill that field up with Grapes and Olives. Okay. But hopefully, I don't know how flat the field is, but I wouldn't mind like putting the... the I think the, it's relatively flat. Put a shed there, you know. That kind of stuff, you know. Would be kind of nice. Uh, so that convey all trailer does have pellet fertilizer in it, but this sprayer or this planter takes a liquid fertilizer. So it's a you can't, you know. Yeah. Yeah, Waldo just said he's bringing liquid for it to the field, you guys. We'll have it. Yep, I want to build a, sh a shed up there so all the grape and olive equipment just stays up there. Uh, that's my theory anyway. Just it all stays, you know. So. Lots of trees for Matt around number 11, is there? So that's my theory, guys. Yeah, I know. That's what he's got it in, guys. That's what it's in. We actually did get it done before 3 o'clock, boys. Good job. Uh, <laughs> this is the saddle track tractor from the uh, pre-order bonus. Seven minimum rows. Wow. Yeah, so all the equipment I want to keep separate up there, you know. There is a, well, it's the animal tanker, but yes, it'll hold liquid for it. It will. So if you keep everything in one spot, you can have frame rate issues as well. So that's another reason to kind of disperse everything around the map a little bit, which is actually kind of why, in my opinion, if you guys notice the four corners of the map, you have different farms for like the animals. They're all spread out, right? They're kind of set up that way. Like up here would be sheep. I forget what the other ones are, but there's like signs and everything there. So they give you like basically kind of a spot to put your four different stuff. It just kind of makes sense that way, you know, and that helps you spread out your equipment. Therefore spread out your leg. How long is my stream going to be on Saturday? Uh, 10 hours. Okay. Um, what's up? Is somebody in the truck? Or... I yeah, know, somebody's I in the truck. And that's fine. You just... We get rid of the solid fertilizer cart? I mean... I'm not getting filled. This is uh, also hold the seed, guys. I think you need to pull forward maybe just a smidge. This thing's not, it's, I don't like the trailer, to be honest. I really don't like it for seed. It, oh, there it goes. There we are. The triggers are so Thank finicky. You. I don't know if it's the cedar or if it's the, the convey all, to be honest. I really don't know which one it is. It's definitely one of them. Though. No, I'm too far away. I know that. I'm probably too close. Oh, look at that. Got it first try. How about them apples, chat? Yeah, this Jeff. Easy. 
Terminator actually did say yesterday they're looking into being able to delete all the buildings uh, that you can't use on property that you own kind of thing. So they're looking into it, Jeff. Which is good. I want bulldozer to do it, though. Right. Can you imagine a big silage blade on the front of this thing? And then stack a <laughs> bunch of weights on the back, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, no, we we use our solid fertilizer spreaders after we uh, harvest, so no, we're not going to get rid of them. Ah. We are not going to get rid of them. All right. Um, I need to go take my break. Dang, look at this. It's actually... Okay, I'm going right now. I'll be back, boys. Okay.